today we're going to be talking about the most asked question I get asked on all the social medias and that is how do I get so many Instagram followers and today I'm going to explain how you can up your Instagram gain more followers gain more likes and get more views on your videos so grab your phone and let's get into it the first method I used which I'm not proud of to be honest and I don't suggest doing it but it's also the quickest way to gain followers is by adding and removing people constantly so with Instagram I think you can do about 60 or something in an hour you can add people and remove people before it gives you like a temporary ban or something like that for spamming basically so the quickest way that I did used to do when I started Instagram was literally just follow people and then unfollow them I don't recommend doing that because people are going to block you you'll get a bad reputation and you'll get a bad name for it but I know I did wrong but I'm going to be honest with you guys that is how I very first started but now I do a different method which is a lot better so if you are going to add and remove people and gain followers very quickly like that do it off the right profile so what I mean by that is my channel is very much magic related as you know through Instagram as well everything's magic related if what I did I think I used to use Dynamo and David Blaine were my main two guys I used to go on everyone who followed them and follow and remove all those guys so if I followed one of them, if they're following Dynamo, let's say, they then look at my page because I follow them, they see it's magic as well. They like they obviously like magic or something if they're following David Blaine Dynamo and then they started following me. So that was a very quick way to gain followers. The method I use now and which I recommend as well is I'm gonna talk to you whilst having my phone and show you exactly what I do on Instagram and how I gain those likes, views and followers. So get your phone and follow along. So the first thing we are going to need to do obviously is open up our Instagram. So I haven't done much over the last few days because I wanted to test this out. So you can see recently I've gained quite a few followers, not sure why. However, if I just click on them, look at that. No posts, kind of a spam page by the looks of it. Not sure what that is. Let's load that. Mm, three comments. Another spam page. I hate it when I get that. So they're following loads of people. It even says they're a spam account. How weird. So you can sometimes get that. But the likes and stuff, not many over the last few days. You say two days ago, three days ago. Normally when I post something, I can gain quick likes and quick views very quickly over the first day I'll get about 200 300 likes or so so as you can see on my profile we got 17,000 followers at the moment and everything is pretty much magic related some of the stuff there will be 40,000 views on some of the stuff there will only be a thousand on and that's just the way Instagram works sometimes it wants to share something quite fast sometimes it doesn't it's all the algorithm. Let's have a look at that. 28,000 views compared to the one after it. 2,000 views. That's just the way it works. And you gotta bear that in mind. So don't worry if that one video is getting a big amount of views and the other isn't. I'll explain that all soon. So if you wanna get more views and more followers, this is one step you can take. When you're on your search profile, it will come up with all the stuff that you have that it thinks that you'll like and stuff already so obviously a lot of mine is whether it's Rubik's Cube stuff magic cards, magic tricks don't know why I said magic cards, cards, tricks and so on what you can do is literally just go through all those and start liking them if you start liking them like the stuff because they're all related to your channel as well and not sure why I like that one we're going to unlike that because I don't know who that is same with that. If it's cards related, I'll start liking them. So you can go through all your search profile as long as you've liked other stuff related to your channel and just start liking all those. Start liking those, people are gonna 
go on to your channel as well that you've liked. Now this is why sometimes you'll gain more views compared to other stuff. So in your tricks and stuff, let's go on to this one, you need the right hashtags. So for instance, these are some of the hashtags that I use. As you can see there, we've got magic, we've got magic trick, card tricks, cards, magician, illusion, cardistry, sleight of hand, shin limb, giveaway, because that one was a giveaway, illusionist. So use the appropriate hashtags, that's really important. So the reason why we want those appropriate hashtags is when someone is searching something, so for instance, my search stuff is normally magic trick, card history, card tricks, stuff like that. So I go into magic trick and you can see it always shows a top nine post up on here. So you're not going to get that straight away, but when you do, that's when your views go up quite a lot. Other than that, you can go on the most recent and scroll through all those and like them and they will also probably go back onto your channel and like back. So go on to the appropriate hashtags and start liking stuff. Yes, it's a bit of a ball ache, but this is the way to do it. If you want really quick likes, then the hashtags to use that I find is using the hashtag LFL, which stands for like for like. Also use the hashtag like for like, as you can see, and also use the hashtag 420 which for magic I'd say use that because 420 is obviously smoking weed and stuff like that and people that are high watching magic they love it so that's the only reason why I use that but yeah those are the ones that I use like for like LFL they'll gain you quick likes very quickly a quicker way to gain stuff is by actually watching people's videos and commenting on them but make it positive comments and sort of good criticism if you're going to do it so let's say if we're going to watch this trick here so that was really super clean bottom palm so super clean love it that's what i'm going to write on there put a little emoji just to some co constructive criticism what i don't want to do or for you to do is put comments on there saying Oh, I really like that you should check out my channel as well so stuff like that which is promoting your own channel people are either gonna block you or remove you or just completely ignore you because you're not really helping them you're just writing to promote your own channel so write the appropriate comments which you like so I really like that one I'm just gonna put dope photo because that is a pretty cool one great caption that I love that like it as well so with Instagram there's always certain channels which will promote certain things and such so there's loads of channels there which will just play people's magic tricks and stuff like that if you are tagging them in your photo they are likely to share it as well and that's a quick way to gain followers as well I'm just going to show you my favorite because these guys help me out a lot which is slightly smoking I need to go on people they are magic company and you can see on here they are just showing everyone's sort of videos and stuff and if they're going to share your video they've got top magicians following them and that's how you're going to gain quick views on your channel and subscribers as well followers so on and so on so they've got loads that they're promoting on there another one as well that is quite often showing my stuff is big tricks let me just find them so a little bit of a smaller channel, but there you go, that's one of me. But it's 200 odd views. Not all those guys would have been following me before. Who knows, I'm not sure, but yeah, they're sharing plenty of stuff. There's some which obviously don't do as much as others, but some channels which are sharing all the time. As long as you tag them in it, you can gain quite a lot of views. Now I'm gonna show you why you should now link your other two social medias as well. If you're using any other social medias, you want to make sure that they're all linked together. So, for instance, everyone who's using Instagram should also be using Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, so on and so on. But not everyone is. So, let's say, for example, I know I've got quite a lot of friends which never touch Twitter in their life. However, they use Facebook only, 
Um, so I will share everything I do on Instagram, onto Twitter, onto Facebook, onto YouTube. So everyone gets a chance to see everyone. I know a lot of people on YouTube who will be watching this don't have Instagram, Twitter or Facebook as well. But it's good to download all of them, link them all into each other. Leave the description in each of them as well so that they can follow certain channels on just the links that you leave. So for instance, if I went onto Instagram, sorry, Twitter, you can see I don't do as much anymore on it, but I've got 13 and a half followers, 13.8k followers. I just follow everyone who follows me on that. Um, Facebook as well, YouTube as well. Obviously YouTube's the newest thing that's slowly growing up to six, 700 but everything's got links onto my other channels. The final thing I'm going to talk to you about is on Instagram that you get a lot of people following and unfollowing you. Kind of like the same method that I explained at the beginning. I use this app called Followers on iOS. I'm not sure what it'll be on Android, but you just type in Followers and it'll basically show you people who have recently followed you, people who have recently unfollowed you. It'll load that up and that will just show everyone. So if someone follows me and they're magic related, I will follow them back because I like the magic and everything. However, I will always be on that app checking who unfollows me. And if they unfollow me straight away, I know that it's kind of like a spam account that they're just going up and down like I used to. And I'll unfollow them back again because, and probably block them as well, just because it's a bit annoying. That's it guys, so that's just my methods that I have used over the time and it has worked. Like I said, two different methods, one that's quick but likely to get you blocked by a lot of people, give you a bad reputation, and the other one is slow and a bit tedious, however it will gain you the right followers and in the long time I think you'll prefer that you did it that way. So hopefully you all do it that way. and. Just let me know in the comments how it goes. Hope you enjoy the video and I'll see you again soon.